Good evening, boasting a 29-4 overall record, the Gannon women's basketball team faced Charleston in the opening round of the NCAA Atlantic Regional Tournament. Let's go to the highlights from Glenville State in West Virginia. First half action, Markaya McCormick buries a corner three-pointer for the Golden Eagles as they trailed 16-7. We'll skip to the third quarter of play. Charleston up 47-34, West Middlesex grad Delaney Dogan with the back down and score. Cuts the deficit down to 11. She finished with 10 points, 4 rebounds. Less than 6 minutes to play. Sam Perasco gets open underneath and scores. She had a team-high 23 points. Less than 3 to play. Gannon down 7. Bree Claxon buries the triple. She had 17 points. It's a 4-point game. The Golden Knights in this one, one of 18 from downtown. Now tied at 65 in the final 2 minutes. McCormick with a tough runner. She led all scores with 27 points. Gannon would be forced to foul after a turnover, and Charleston would go up by four. Lady Knights with one last shot. Down four, Claxon misfires from three, and Gannon falls 69-65 in the first round of the Atlantic Regional as they see their season come to an end with a record of 29 wins and five losses. Gannon jumped out. You, know, you have an 11 point quarter in the, in the second quarter and dig a little bit of hole, it takes a lot of energy to get back. And, um, and uh, we still we were able to do that and the ball just didn't you know, bounce our way at the end. But um, um, credit to Charleston, I thought they, they played an excellent game. I played with the seven seniors for a while and they love the program. I mean, they show everything that Gannon's about. So just playing with them and showing Bree, our freshman, and Andy, our other freshman, how we want to run things is truly awesome. Day one, as soon as I got here, they took me under their wing immediately and showed me the way that this program worked. Um, and so they've kind of taught me how I can do that uh, for the incoming people as well. So, you know, they, they just did a great job. So Gannon falls 69-65 in their final two games of the regular season and postseason, I should say. The Golden Knights went dry from shooting from downtown. They went 4 of 39 from behind the arc.